Hey friends, welcome back. Uh, so today is uh, the first live recording session at LM. Uh, we're starting a concert series here called, cleverly enough, Live from LM. Uh, so the band's about to be here in maybe 20 minutes or so. I figured the stage, big air quotes, stage is sort of set up. I figured I would show you guys the rig. Um, so the uh, main interface here is a Persona Studio Live 24R. Um, we are tracking everything into Nuendo uh, here. And then we are also having several channels of AVB uh, handled over the Motu 24AI and 24AO. Um, so I have as many inputs as I can into these Focusrite ISA 828s. Uh, will the preamp sound better than the Personas? Probably not, but I have them. I figured it was a swag move to do that. So um, headphones are being handled by, um, I'm doing four mixes uh, out of this headphone amp right here. Uh, and then three mixes will have um, individual headphone amps on mic stands. So we are running six mono mixes for this band, or excuse me, six stereo mixes and two mono mixes for this band. Um, uh, two of the members are just guests and I figured we would take our cabling down. So the main band is all on stereo ears. Uh, so this is the production. We call this the initiation department here at LM. So we're going to set the drums up on this table. This is where cases kind of get built. Um, and then the uh, silver racks that you're seeing behind there are silk screens. So we thought that would be a cool a cool background. So uh, as far as the air quote stage goes, uh, each of the band members has a quad box. So this is a LM a Tour Systems product. So every band member gets four outlets. Um, we're running, as far as inputs go, I think we're at 30 inputs for this. Um, so we've just got, got a, a couple of sub snakes here. Nice and labeled. Everything is color coded. Drums are yellow. So if you look at a malt box like this, uh, drums are yellow, bass is pink, keys are blue. So again, this is just sort of roughly set up here. Uh, I am using radial catapults to get over here uh, for a saxophone player and a background singer. So I've got all these malt boxes labeled here. So I will uh, check in with you guys again once the band gets here and set up, you can see our director of photography, a one Adam Diacentis poking his head through silk screens back there, giving us some cool uplight. Hey, <laughs> so uh, we'll check back in once the, uh, once the band gets here. All right, so here is, uh, we just finished sound check. So we're about to start recording. Got Jamie. Got Adam. What up? <laughs> Got Ethan. <laughs> Nobody can hear my sound. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here's drums. Yeah, they are. We got the D6 in the kick. Beta 56 on the snare. SPD and stereo, the three outputs, left and right for tracks, a separate output for the click track. Up here, we've got 451s as overheads, a ATM 450 on hi-hat. And then going further over here in Drumland, 421 on the floor tom, 421 on the gong drum that fell that we need to now change. We got background vocals over here, SM7, saxophone, beta 57, guitar amp, the 609, and we're also taking that DI. Here's bass. Avalon U5 for bass and pedals, and here we go. Oh yeah, M88, lead vocals, there we go. And Jamie. Yeah, that's... Tasteful fade that's out. That's me. Tasteful fade out. 